What is it? Yeah, I spent a lot of time tinkering up and down the river delta. Once Owen's army came to town, I lit out of there faster than a tassel worm with its bottom ablaze. I'm so frazzled, I accidentally left behind a few irreplaceables. What irreplaceables? Well, just one, really. An orb. I'd be mighty grateful if you would find it. What is it? And if you come across any of my old, beautifully rusted armor pieces, I'll use the scrap to whip up something specially suited just for you. What is the orb? Just bring it back here and you'll make me happy as a sunbeam. Oh, and don't forget to keep an eye out for my old armor. I'll fix it up for you. Mm. Recharge! What sort of orb do you imagine we're looking for, brother? I do not know. Should we ask him? Don't be rude. What's rude about asking for help? Big Veer, my love. Focus on your work. Your you alliance is unusual. I think what Kratos is trying to say is... ...he's never seen a Light Elf and Dark Elf work together. It's a welcome sight. Hopefully one day, a common one. Mimir tells me you're something of an adventurer. Should you ever find your way to the Forbidden Sands and Alpine... Contested territory. Past the Barrens. There are rumors of a sanctum. ...and artifacts our elders don't want us to see. Anything that sheds light on our suppressed history would benefit all of Alfheim. Uncovering secret history? Sounds like my kind of adventure. Knowledge of the Elves' common ancestry is what brought us together. Stories of Alfheim before the division of light and dark... ...it's very taboo. Didn't stop you from spreading word of it. We... ...is how you ended up in prison. Where she and I met. As enemies, naturally, but escaped as friends. More than friends. You can stop talking. Okay. <clears throat> Good luck out there. An old Vanaheim lullaby. Looking for something? We can head out the way we came.
I remember where to look for a gateway. Follow me. Well, you two seem to be getting on since completing your mission. Dare I hope this alliance has some staying power after all? It seems to me we share a common enemy. Kratos, you may not accept that Ragnarok is inevitable, but you're smart enough to know Odin is a threat. Whatever comes next, our best chance of surviving it is to work together. Do you agree? I do. Then as to Brock's offer, you can imagine staying under the same roof as a couple former enemies? No further temptations towards terrible vengeance? Not against you. Either of you. You have my word. This lock is different from others you might know. You'll need an enchantment on your chisel to use it. Runa. Go ahead, carve the letter. Suna. It's an incantation. I'll speak it. Suna. Lovely. Working together is already opening doors for us. Uh, is he always making puns like that? We're blocked by more vines. Remember what to do? log in the river. It has something on it I don't recognize. We're clear. So it's true. Tears really alive? Aye. Not exactly ship shape. He sleeps in a broom closet now. But he's adjusting. How did you find him? Largely, that's down to Atreus having figured out how to access the prophecies giants reserved for their own kind. We only learned of it ourselves after Thor and Odin came calling. To your home? Is it still standing? Barely. But all the violence was seemingly just a distraction to let Odin have a private word with Atreus. Odin was alone with your son? Did he tell you what they spoke of? Yes. He said that Odin invited him to Asgard to help him find his answers. The answers he's rushing into fate in search of. 
That's troubling. Well, if you're ready to talk to him, the Mystic Gateway is ahead. If not, I have some unfinished business up this river I could use your help with. Or we can follow up on that elven sanctum out in Alfine's desert. If you want to continue exploring, we'll need to remove that log in the river. Giants definitely crack. They're good. We can explore the river now. And hopefully right some old wrongs. What is your unfinished business? I left something behind, near the falls. Your wedding, sir. Now why do you want to be going back there? To be free of the bonds of my marriage. And to ask him. I think you severed that a long time ago. Not completely. Not enough. Guide us. My people settled this river many ages ago. Thousands traveled it on pilgrimage to the Shrine of Worship. But then the Aesir came. This is all that's left. Reavers, of course.
What is wrong? Please, leave me to my prayers. I await Freya, the great healer. I am here. She will cure me. I have been a loyal follower. She would not abandon... <coughs> I am Freya. What do you need? Only she can cure my sickness. With Mangold, Maya, and Poe. We must help her. She demands a cure. She is dead. She is trapped here, ignorant of her own death. If we bring her what she needs, she'll move on. You're certain? I'm not going to do nothing. She needs Mangold, Meyer, and Pong. We should find some. said the ace here burned him yes we weren't yet at war but relations with the vanir and aesir had been hostile for ages freyer got it into his head that he could improve relations by sharing our magic with them vanir techniques for bountiful harvests enough to feed their whole population getting set on fire was the thanks he got that's true you know what We'll finish this later. This crest belonged to Odin, a peace offering from my people. And a waste of good work. Inside of that building. Can you see anything valuable in here? The gate's open. We can head back and get inside.
weren't always this relevant. Give me system. It's out of balance. This desolation, a fitting fate. Astrid, no. This mentions a spell that puts trolls to sleep, and a magic relic that acts as a sort of counter spell. Armor piece bearing Lunda's brand. Shame it's broken. Nice bit of work otherwise. Then why leave it? You suspicious of her, brother? If the orb she seeks is important, she would not have left it behind. Ah, uh, perhaps. Take right there! Left flank! Yeah. 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 Incoming! Uh, I'm up here! Uh, Oh, 
to you, to your garden. The angry are my life's work rotted. My monument to your glory reduced to this. I am sorry, my queen. You need never apologize to me, old friend. I swore to keep this garden in bloom until it returned to live forever amongst its putrescence. A just punishment. I will return, Astrid. Kratos, we purge this garden of poison. Why? The Earth is a reflection of those who tend it. So long as the land is plagued, her soul will be as well. We have to destroy the totems. They're poisoning Astrid's garden. When my garden blooms, so Life returns to the garden. Good. This garden still aches. There must be more poison somewhere. Family crest of Henir. Can you see if there's a way inside while you're up there? What's it say, brother? Turn to Astrid. The land, it's alive yes. again. Your garden grows again. Freya, how did you? It's okay, Astrid. It's time to move on. Thank you, goddess. I do love you. And I you. You've done a great kindness. A temporary one. The garden will die again. All things do. That is no reason not to try.
Waterfalls. We're close. There should be a gate up ahead. That's quite a gate. Don't suppose you know a way through? The Pilgrim Gate. I can open it. We just need to find the right vantage point. Yeah. What do you recall of the Aesir turning on Freya? Oh, he certainly didn't deserve it. Another time. We must focus. Lord, get it! Out of <laughs> Incoming! Above you! <laughs> <laughs> What is wrong? I died. And you will help me. Of course, Gunhild. But to what end? When the Ain Heriar came, we needed a way to fight back. I suggested. Say them. I understand your desperation, but... 
That was foolish. Clearly. I was lucky enough to be murdered before my mind could be corrupted, as theirs did. You must free them. Of course. Say their magic corrupts so ruthlessly. Those poor souls must be in agony. Then we shall give them death. like more of Lunda's old armor. Nearly have the complete set now. Must be safer this way. We'll need to find another way around. Anything interesting, brother? turning on Freya. Oh, he certainly didn't deserve it. 
The Aesir were too undisciplined and impatient for the subtlety of Vanir spellcraft. So when things went wrong, they blamed their teacher. So Freyr was a guest when Odin burned him? Not exactly. Not now. does still care for you. I know. I raised a son, too. It may be hard to believe, but he was quite similar to Atreus at this age. He adored his father, always wanted to do right by him, and was constantly frustrated that no matter what he did, he never could seem to get his approval. He confided in me a lot, sought the comfort his father withheld. I wonder if your son could benefit from that, too. He has befriended the other dwarf. The Blue One's brother. Oh. Well, if Sindri has that covered, I suppose there's no need for me in his life anymore, is there? That is not what I meant. That was sarcasm. What did you mean when you said Frey was not exactly a guest of the Aesir? I meant by the time they burned him, he'd been a prisoner for some time. Odin didn't mind locking Frey up. He saw the potential of the magic and wanted to know more than how to improve crop yields. It was a mob of lesser Aesir, bitter and short-sighted. He tied him up and lit him aflame as punishment for the sabotage they imagined him guilty of. Obviously, he survived. In fact, he used the opportunity to escape. But such an affront made war inevitable. Freyr certainly wasn't the same after that. At least for a while. His carefree ways were replaced with nightmares, paranoia, and lashing out. It doesn't excuse what he said at my wedding, but... I do understand where his anger came from. Freya, there's something I've always wanted to ask. What was it Grimthur whispered to you? Who? Grimthur. The son of Thormur, the stonemason, who disguised himself and built Asgard's wall. Oh, yes. One of the many occasions Odin saw fit to involve me in a wager without my consent. I wish I could say that was the worst of his husbandly habits. Enough. We will continue later. you find? As you ask. A no song, you weary. Ah!
you recognize her? The sickly spirit. No. There was a time I could recall the face of every one of my people, but... Sometimes I wonder if gods live too long. I once felt the same. Good thing you learned the runes, brother. <laughs>